And here in Lagos State, the government is currently building a large capacity rehabilitation center. The project is to address issues of increasing victims of drug abuse in the state. Special advisor to the governor on sustainable development goals and investments, Shalakwe Hammond, disclosed this on Monday. It was at a press conference to unveil the official launch of a platform tagged Lagos SDGs Youth Alliance. The platform is designed to engage youth in productive ventures. Plus TV Africa's government house correspondent, Love Ikuku Oyedokun, reports. As a government, we recognize the value of collaboration and engagement. The use of psychoactive substances among young people in Nigeria is assuming a worrisome dimension. Causes have been traced to peer pressure and the desire to exploit. This press conference by the Lagos State Government is to discuss ways to mitigate these causes and the harmful effects. The birth of this lofty special advice to the Governor on Sustainable Development Goals and Investment, Sholakbe Hammond, leaks the conference. She introduces a plan for the largest rehabilitation centers in Africa. Perhaps the Lagos State SDG's Youth Alliance is a platform to the rescue. And so this is something that the state takes very, very seriously. Um, so the Ministry of Youth uh, and Social Development has developed a handbook that we're all you know, working to implement. There will be a lot of interventions around uh, drug abuse. We are building one of the largest drug rehabilitation centers in Africa um, currently as we speak. Youths are supposed to be change agents, but many of them have been destroyed by drug abuse, rendering them unproductive. But the Lagos State government is all out to bring these menace to its knees. Certainly we're starting a new journey and shaping an exciting future by enabling young people to immerse in a, in a social reality and responsibility that will help unleash a new tribe of citizens that are committed to common good. Ladies and gentlemen, we are poised to make this movement a special purpose vehicle that will drive a society of resourceful youth whose potentials are, to be, are yet to be, are to be harnessed to drive the greater Lagos ambition by channeling their energy, education, intellect and resourcefulness towards positive engagement for a better future. Now, having a substantive engagement with young women and men, no doubt, will improve the efforts of the Lagos State Government to establish positive influence on the society. From the Bukato Press Centre, Ikeju, Lagos, Love Ikuku Oyedokun. Reporting for Plus TV. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.